Hello there, KellerQ204 here. Here is part three of a brief history of two Swedish directors of this golden age of Swedish silent cinema. Part three, I'm now going to talk about their directing style. I'm going to start off with Vector Surström. Vector Surström was well known for his redemption narrative and rural settings and double exposure for some narrative. I'm going to give you an example. His uh, most well known and that would be The Phantom Carriage. I'll show you a two videos of Victor Surstrom directed. The movie is called The Man There Was and the whole thing of his narrative of redemption. Now I'm going to talk about Morton Stiller's directing style. His directing style is, leads more into action-packed and comedy. One of the action-packed movies uh, that he did was a movie called Johan. I'm going to show you one or two clips action-packed. Here is an example of one of his comedy, Thomas Merle's best film. That became a very big success, and First Child was the sequel, 1918. But there's no what month and the date of the month. But check the check the movie out t uh, as well. It's quite hilarious. Even though they both worked on separate films and worked together on either writing or directing, they both did some movies. Even though that they were top-notch directors during the silent age of Swedish cinema, they were lifelong friends. Before Stiller passed away of Late stages of pleurisy on 1928. Victor Surstrom was by his bedside. They did chat for a few minutes, but Stiller passed away hours after they chatted. Well, that is a brief history of two Swedish directors during the golden age of silent Swedish cinema. I would suggest uh, to check out their filmography. They are very tasteful, in my opinion. Anyways, have a good day, and I'll see you in the next podcast. Thank you.